Hi there, I'm Wenzel Jones and this is Patty Negri's Cure Audition video. So here's the horrible story. I'm on my way to work and I don't have a lot of agency at the job I do. Um, I work with somebody who's got this managerial style that consists of uh, coming in and saying, I've got an idea, make it happen with no instruction or materials or background or deadline. And of course, I'm thinking, I have an idea, shut up. So um, it's not a happy place in my head at work. And one day when I was talking to Patty about perhaps instituting happy hour at noon at my desk, she said to me, you know, there's a better way. And she um, told me about her magical stress relief tea. Uh, but Patty being Patty, it wasn't just as simple as making a cup of tea. There was chanting involved and there are steps involved and it's very much like a Japanese tea ceremony. So it's not something you can really do in the break room. But I did it. And I've got to say, if you cannot have a, a martini at the desk, stress relief tea is remarkably effective. So yeah, I am here totally sold on stress relief tea when you can't have a Manhattan. All right, here we go. Um, welcome to my home. This is my cute little witch's cottage in the Hollywood Hills. Come on in. Hi. Welcome to my home. Um, you wanted to see my house? This is my living room. Here we'll go in circles. <laughs> That's my lovely husband taking the shots. Um, come in. This is into my dining room. Come on in. Some of my magical workings everywhere. This is my... That's my notes. That's my notes. This is my kitchen. This is where I make my magical stress relief tea. Oh, you wanted to see my yard too. Come here for one moment. Here you go. Okay. It's raining right now. It's raining for the first time in 17 years, I believe. Ah. So, so we won't go too far. But peek out here. Down here in my garden, we have beautiful downslope property. And look way down there. I try to grow some of the herbs myself for some of my tinctures and some of my potions and my magic. But it's not very easy to do because all the little critters seem to eat them up. So let's go back in the house because we're getting wet. My beautiful deck, which is great on a... Which is lovely on a nice sunny day like is it today. But we could sit and we could listen to the Hollywood Bowl and watch the fireworks from right here. So come on in. All right. That's our cat, Larry. This is our movie star dog, Dora. She just finished a movie with Morgan Fairchild and Alicia Witt, all about wiener dog races. She's a star. Um, okay, so let's tell you about, a little bit about my product right here. Um, as I stated on the thing, I, I'm a witch. I'm a good witch. I don't worship the devil. I don't turn people into frogs. But I do take charge of fate. I do create my own reality. And I do believe that people all have the option to actually do that. Um, so in my work with herbs and oils and magical potions and things, um, I, out of necessity, came up with my stress relief tea. My husband, my beautiful husband, who's a drummer, when he had a day job, it stressed him out terribly. He would come home with just smoke coming out of his ears. It was terrible. And I was like, what can I do? What can I do? This wasn't working. I wasn't used to this. He wasn't used to this. So I was like, well, I'm going to mix some of my herbs together. So the concoction I came up with is some Damiana leaf. And I'm going to read you because you guys asked for this. And if, if this goes to TV, I would memorize this. But again, you gave me like a minute and a half to do this. Um, Damiana leaf. If the it's 
Its official name, since you asked for that, is Tumera diffusa. It's a wild shrub grown in Mexico, Central America, and the West Indies. The leaves and stems are used to make medicine. Hysteri historically, or hysterically, used to incre increase sexual desire in both sexes and to bo boost mental focus and stamina. Um, the, the mental focus and stamina, I think, are both really good as part of the stress release, because with stress, sometimes your head gets all foggy. It's used to treat headaches. Again, this works for headaches, like I said. Bedwetting. I can't claim that one. Depression and nervous stomach and constipation, all of which go with stress. So I put in a pinch, but if you, for the medical thing, you could always say an, a, a, a teaspoon of each or an ounce of each, so the Damiano leaf. Then we're going to add some mugwort. And the official name for mugwort is Artemisa vulgaris. It is used for everything. I could give you this whole list here that you don't need to focus in on, but from everything from abscesses to an antispasmodic to arthritis to bruising to all sorts of things. Um, it, it, stomach pains and disorders and stress, stress is one of its things. So I put in my pinch or my ounce or my teaspoon of mugwort. The one thing I must say, no pregnant women should use mugwort at all. It actually, it is so relaxing, it relaxes the uterus. So expect it, shouldn't, shouldn't even touch it, expectant mothers. It's completely safe for everybody else. My next magical ingredient is dandelion. And the official name for dandelion is Terra Axum Officinal. And it is rich in vitamins. This is beautiful. Dandelion, you should eat it. You should put it on salads. You should put it in tinctures. Um, it's high in vitamin A, C, E, B complex, iron, calcium, magnesium, potassium, and zinc. Um, they're one of the highest sources of vitamin K, too. Um, they've been reported, the roots have been reported to lower blood sugar and cholesterol levels, lower blood pressure, reduce inflammation and have microbial effects against candida. So who doesn't need that? So again, same equal amount, pinch, ounce, or teaspoon of that. So I was working with these three ingredients and it was working, but I needed something special, that next step. Then I found it. It was hyssop. I don't even have it in the right box uh, because I go through this a lot. Hyssop is a nervine and it can be used to cause anxiety. Um, it's, really, it's a digestive stimulant, but it also it could be good, and, and it also helps fight colds and bronchitis, and you're getting sick, so add it into there. But it's really good just for the anxiety. So it was this little fourth ingredient that ah, just brought out the best of the other three ingredients, and the four together in equal amounts. But we're not there then. This in itself has the magical, has the medicinal properties to relieve stress. But I go the next step. I'm a magician, I'm a witch, I believe in intention and focus. So while I'm stirring it, I put it in a mortar pestle just to mix them up and to beat them up a little. Um, I do some vocal sounds, they're called hekas. This is the breath, the breath of life. So I might do some vowel sounds to calm and to give form, because stress leaves you formless. Ah, a, e, o, u, a, ah, a, e. Oh, ooh, a yeah. Even before drinking, I'm feeling the stress go out now with this focus and intention. So I will do that for a little while. I did it on the other tape, so I won't keep it too long. And then you want to charge it. And I, do, I tell people to do this. And at first, that's where some like, I don't know, that's kind of weird stuff. But I just say, just give it a try. Trust me. And the results are so good that people listen, even my husband. <laughs> so anyway, so now we've got these mixed up. We've got some sound, some hecka, some breath of life into it. Now we want to charge it. There's lots of ways we can charge it. Sometimes I rock back and forth. Sometimes I might bring in some Z sounds, some some uh, some guttural. That's the dragon strike between life and breath. Some ooze or a ma chant, ma, where we are empowering it. We are focusing the intent that this anti-stress tea is going to work to relieve all our stress, all our anxiety, any att headaches, attributes, bad stomach that are, are, are you know, part of that. So we're going to do the, oh, I'll do a short version now. It's ready. So now we're going to go stick.
steep it like we steep regular tea. So come on in the kitchen. Okay, I've kind of just cheated here because I've just mixed it all up because we're trying to keep it not too long. But I've put the equal mix in my little tea man, but you can use a tea ball, you could use tea bags, those little cloth bags that they're making. And you do your boiling water and you steep it for about three minutes. Um, and we won't wait three minutes. <laughs> So then we have a beautiful, beautiful tea. It's got a rich, earthy smell. It's even relaxing in itself. And then with the very first sip, you literally feel the stress running out of your body, like dripping out through the palms of your hands and through your feet. The slow calmness takes over everything. So I'm excited. I hope that you guys pick me so you can actually have this tested. I know it works. I have enough people who tell me it works, but I would love to know anything scientific behind it. Um, and if you want a little bit more, I'm going to switch the camera right now and let you meet my fabulous husband, Kerry Crutchfield. And he's a left brain guy. He's not all woo wooey like I am, except that he's a drummer. But let me tell you his experience. I'm going to give up the camera for just a moment. Hold up. Here. You take the tea, honey. Meet my husband, Kerry. Hi. I indeed am the husband, Kerry Crutchfield. Uh, and uh, she's right. Um, I, had a, uh, I had a job for a long time where it was uh, very stressful. I was a general sales manager and finance manager for a large automobile dealership and was responsible for just about everything that went on there. And a typical day would, would, would start at 8 o'clock in the morning and it would end at 10, 30, 11 o'clock at night, uh, six days a week, sometimes seven. Uh, and everything that could go wrong uh, would go wrong, of course. Uh, putting out fires all day long, calamities, uh, dealing with banks, lenders, uh, wholesalers, uh, people didn't uh, follow through credit situations. Uh, a car that we appraised yesterday, they come back today and now it's got a few more dents and you have to politely answer it. And it just, they would get upset and then well, I'll talk to the boss. So the people got to me, they're, they're already heated up and, and just dealing, dealing with all of that and 35 salesmen and, and five sales managers and all the rest of it. Uh, every day it was like a zoo. And sometimes I would come home and my head was just fried. I was like losing it. And then Patty created this tea. And I drank the tea, and it was like, wow, it was this transformation. I mean, it was like, you know, I don't know. It was like the immediate effect of, of, of having some uh, something at a hospital put into me, you know, medication of some sort. But just like, ooh, but it's tea. So whatever it is she's doing uh, certainly worked for me. So I can heartily recommend uh, Madame Negri here uh, for this particular uh, formation. Thank you. Okay. Okay. All right, here's my last moment of selfie with me and my husband. I hope this works. I'm doing this really rusty. Um, I'm teaching a workshop tonight on love magic, if anybody wants to come, but I guess you'll be seeing this after the effect. Um, so again, Patty Negri, I hope you pick me. I would love my tea, my magical, magical tea to be tested. I know I wore black, I wasn't supposed to, but I couldn't help it, I'm leaving any second. So I hope this works. Pick me, pick me. Pick her. S signing off, bye. Bye. Ah, uh, turn it off.